Broadcasting from the great Pacific Northwest and around the world online, live from the Broiler Room Studios, the Griffin Hart Studios, <laughs> and the Broiler Room at Griffin Hart Studios. It's a really big old time radio medicine show. Three chords in the truth starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, Do. And Molly Griffin, you just called me an old fart. I did. And I got something to say about that. There's no such thing as an old fart, Molly. <laughs> they dissipate like <laughs> really quick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby. It is an unpleasant notion, though. You know what I like, Ma. Do you like the Chantilly Lace? I like the Chantilly <laughs> Lace. I like a pretty face. I like a ponytail. Hanging, Hanging down. down. I like a wiggle in your wall. Hey, you know what I was going to start the show off with? Dog. I was going to start the show off with, um, you know that old song? Look what they've done to my song, Mom. Look what they've done to my song. Melanie Safka. Yeah. Hey, it's the only thing that I could do at riding is turn that all wrong, my mama. Look what they've done to my song. Okay, that's not what I was going to say. I was going to say this. Uh. Look what they've done to my hair, mom. <laughs> Look what they've done to my hair. It's the only thing that I could do have right, and it's turned out all wrong, oh, Molly. Look what they've done to my song. Okay. Hair. Kick back and chill out because it can be real, real. I decided that the show has to be even more mellow. Even more mellow you know than what? before. Because a guy commented, and, and here's how nice people are, right? Mm -hmm. His comment says, a thousand words cannot express five fingers on the guitar. And I said, so what you're saying is, <laughs> shut the fuck up and play the guitar. <laughs> Nice. I don't think just guitar with us would work. No. no. Oh, I could do a little. You could do Buck Pokemon. <laughs> do it. Do it, Dad. No, I'm not going to. Show us what you could once no, do. I'm not going to. I'm going to, but what I will do is a little John Fogarty. Okay. You want to do some John? Yeah. I feel like you're buzzing. Oh. Try that. Tight. I like it tight. I did nothing. Okay, do you want to try another key, maybe? Yeah, that sounds good. Take me back down with the cool water slow, y'all. Let me remember things that I don't know. Stopping at the log where the catfish fight. Whoa, I'm walking along the road at night. Pepper girls hold the dancing in the I can hear the bullfrog calling me, y'all. One in my rope still hanging through the tree, y'all. Love to keep my feet way down, shallow water, shoot, fly, drag, and back to back to your mother, and pick up a fly rock and skip it across Green River. Up at Cody's camp, I spend my days on Black car riders and cross style walkers Oh, Cody Jr. He took me over he Said you're gonna find a world that's colder And if you get lost, just come on home to Green River If you get lost, just come on home to Green River well, it's 7.30, 7 coming out of the sky. I want to take me down to Memphis on a midnight ride on the moon. Sail in a traveling van, oh yeah. And hey, I'm flying across the land, I'm trying to get a hand. Playing in a traveling van. <laughs> take me to the hotel, baggage gone, oh well. Come on, come on, won't you get me to your room? I want to move. Sail in a traveling van. Oh yeah, hey I'm flying across the land, I'm trying to get a hand, playing in a traveling band. 
traveling band. Playing in a traveling band. Playing in a traveling band. Won't you give my town a hand? Cause I'm playing in a traveling band. Hey, I'm flying across the land, I'm trying to get a hand. Playing in a traveling band. Listen to the radio, talking about the last show. Someone got excited, had to call the state militia on a move. Playing in a traveling band. Appropriate for the night, don't you? Yes, there, yes. Hey, I'm flying across the land, I'm trying to get a hand. Playing in a traveling band. Here we come again on a Saturday night with your fussing and your fighting. Won't you get me to my ride on the moon? Playing in a traveling band. Oh, yeah. Hey, I'm flying across the land, I'm trying to get a hand Playing in a traveling band Hey, I'm flying across the land, I'm trying to get a hand Playing in a traveling band Oh Yeah, I was playing in a traveling band with John John the Pogarty Man That's Irish too, you know is it? And when I say uh, up at Cody's camp, yeah, that was actually the nephew. Oh yeah, of Buffalo Bill Cody. Oh, not the Buffalo Bill in Silence of the Lambs. No, which I saw the other night. Oh God. Oh my God. Was bad, real bad. I tell you. Yeah, gives me nightmares. But you know, he gets to hold her little hand. You know, he takes her hand like that. <laughs> Did you see that part? <laughs> Jody hey, Foster's little oh hand? No, this is big because this is big for the show. You know the guy, the uh, rockabilly kind of guy that um, did the baby did a bad, bad thing? Yep. Chris Isaac. He was in Silence of the Lambs. Yeah, he's I got know. A, oh, you knew? I know. He's got like a bit part as like a cop. Uh, yeah, yeah, but he's the head cop. Yeah, right, yeah, right, Yeah, it's right. a pretty good part. <laughs> and I thought, you did you think? <laughs> what, that's way back in the where, the 80s? I think it's the early 90s, early to mid 90s. Silence of the Lambs was 90s? I think so. Oh. It's too good a quality, like the filming. Yeah, stuff. Baby Did a could Bad Thing. Could have been the 80s. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, could have been the 80s. Baby Did a Bad, Bad Thing. We better sing one nice song, right? We'll sing uh, on the other end. All right. And then we'll take the ride. Okay. On the one hand, I count the reasons I could stay with you hold it close to me all night long so many lovers games oh I'd like to stay with you on that hand ain't no reason why it's wrong
But the reason I must go is on the other hand. Yeah, the reason I must go is on the other hand. Yeah, the reason I must go is on the other hand. And on the other hand, we have four fingers and a thumb. <laughs> hey, live performance radio, you can see. Singing um, DJs, have you ever heard of such a thing? Ladies and gentlemen, step outside the door to your mind, because there's an old black Cadillac limo waiting just outside, and we're going to take a ride. Cadillac, there's anything you could ever want. It's like a uh, Xanadu Valley, Pleasure Dome Decree, Black 55. We're gonna take a ride. Gonna take a ride. Gonna take a ride. We're gonna take a ride. I pass a honky tonk. I pass a honky tonk. And pass a county line. And pass a county line. To the amber waves of grain. To those waves of grain. And pass a dairy cow with their big brown eyes to the old county line road. It's a country road. The old country road. Gonna take you home. And I'll get his toes hanging out of the window. So this is a great big tower, yeah? Ooh, Ooh, station, 50, watts. station GHRT. Broadcasting online around the world. Uh, oh, station GHRT. Station GHRT. Is there for you and me? Is there for you and me? You can get anything. I can't say that. Buddy Bialis' restaurant. You can get anything, anything you, want. you want. Down at Alice's restaurant. Down at Alice's restaurant. Okay, we're gonna pull in the old station. Gonna go to the front desk and see Betty Page and get your special tea. Ayahuasca tonight. <laughs> Send you down the stairs here to the Psychedelic Prairie Home Companion for the really big old-time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the Truth. I like three chords of some truth, you know? Yeah. Live from the Burl Room Studios. Three Chords and the Truth. Three Chords okay. and the Truth starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, too. And the Reverend Dr. Joey G, too, coming to you live from Station GHRG in the virtual haystack in your mind where the show always starts in five minutes. We don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls. So kick back, chill out, and relax to the mellow sounds of the singing DJ. We spin them on our souls. Spin them on our souls. Spin them on our, our souls. Spin them on our souls. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. <laughs> <laughs> the happiness place on earth is what Patreon says down there where I tell you all about how to get happy. Hey, I got something down about that tonight, and it's a real quickie. Yeah. Not, 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 everything's oh, really, everything's kick back and chill out. You know, I actually felt, uh, uh, you know how many shows we've done, and, and I just heard right now that you introduced me mm -hmm. as the Reverend Dr. Joey G. Yeah. I forgot I was. You didn't know that? I forgot. I just, <laughs> no, I knew it. It was there in my muscle memory somewhere. Oh. But now I will act I more of the part. Yeah. That you've given me. Good. Do it. Look what they've done to my hair, Ma. Covered it up with a cowboy hat. <laughs> you the did name it to yourself. The name of tonight's show is supposed to be, and I hope it turns out good like this, it's supposed to be post-traumatic jest Mess. disorder. No, no, no. It's jest. No. Post-traumatic jest disorder. Well, okay. Because Jimmy Joe called in, you know, he's always ailing. Jimmy and Joe, Jimmy get it Joe together. Come in and he says... He says, Reverend, <laughs> he says, Reverend Doctor, he says, I got the post-traumatic jest. <laughs> Every time I watch the three chords and the truth, afterwards, I've got post-traumatic jest disorder. <laughs> <laughs> and okay. I have to drink for it. <laughs> I have to drink. <laughs> I said, Jimmy Joe. Jimmy Joe. We have unlimited shows. <laughs> They go back for thousands of years, Jimmy Joe. <laughs> and in there, I tell you how to deal somewhere with post-traumatic jest. No, there's no cure for post-traumatic jest disorder except to keep watching the shows. Yeah, keep watching the <laughs> shows, Jimmy Joe. <laughs> Jimmy Joe. numbers. Jimmy Joe. Okay, what do you got up here now, Ma? 
Uh, I got good directions. Cause we haven't played it in a while. I felt like maybe we have. I was sitting there. I was sitting there. Seven turnips <laughs> off a flatbed truck. Crunching on the poor rhyme when she pulled up. Think this is where it next come from. I had the Hollywood <laughs> shit <laughs> last <laughs> place. <laughs> lost <laughs> looking for the interstate. Needing directions. Well, I was a man with a job. Doing good. I told her way up yonder past the caution line. A little country store with an old Coke sign. Stop in, ask Miss Bell for some of her sweet tea. And they left, they take you to the interstate. But here I, right. we'll bring you right back here to me. Catching her name, I threw my hat and thought you fool could have been left. Oh, I knew my no old truck could run her down. She probably didn't like me anyhow. I watched her disappear into a cloud of dust. Gonna take the GHR way, way up yonder past the caution line. Little country store with an old Coke sign. Stop in and ask Miss Bell for some of her sweet tea. Then they ain't left. We take you to the interstate. But here right, we'll bring you right back here to me. Is this Georgia Heat playing tricks on me, or am I really seeing what I? Think I see a woman of my dreams coming back to me. Right back here to me. She went away up yonder past the caution line. I don't know why, but something just fell right. And she stopped in and asked Miss Bell for some of her sweet tea. Oh, Mama gave her a big old glass and sent her right back here to me. Oh, thank God for good directions. And thank God for Mama. And thank God for good directions. Turn and green. Turn. No, she went way up yonder. She went way up yonder. She sure did. Okay, here's the big health part, and I'm going to do it really short and sweet and give a shit all at the same time and, and, and ingest. Always ingest, Tom. Oh, this is, you know, you, cry, you know I, 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 I did a post the other day, and I said, mm -hmm. I said, croc. First, number one mm -hmm. definition, a pot of shit. <laughs> number two definition, that part of your brain that you have no awareness of mm -hmm. the primal and i went i i, I laid it out a little bit mm -hmm. <laughs> I, got mm -hmm. a, I got an opportunity right yeah so croc so that's the word croc mm -hmm. and then i said oh uh you better cooperate with your croc or your life will be a croc or something like that <laughs> 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 yeah right i put it I it's, get it's it, pretty I get good it, you I gotta see it. it it's pretty tricky it pretty tricky yeah you pretty know tricky. what i mean Pretty tricky. Pretty Anyways, tricky guy. this is what I got to say because you know I'm always talking about cooperating with your brain, which wants to evolve, survival, mm -hmm. procreation, evolution. Right? That's what it's all about. Oh yeah. Listen. Oh yeah. Every human brain. Evolution in all living things. Okay, shut up. This is what your croc wants. 
It wants to evolve. Mm -hmm. It really wants to evolve. Mm -hmm. Now, and I've laid it all out down at Patreon, right? Mm -hmm. You can see the whole thing. Mm -hmm. But this is, you know how I often say about w walking to the trough? Mm -hmm. I built the trough. I put the water in it. I led you down there, but I can't make you drink. Mm -hmm. Okay, but this is along the same, same lines. If you and your belief systems want to diverge from the natural you, mm -hmm which involves your crocodile brain. Mm -hmm. C'est la vie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what? what? If you can stay alive doing that, if you can stay alive, it mm -hmm. might be quite evolutionary. Yeah. Because the pain will be. Yeah. The pain and, the pain and conflict will be something terrible, right? Because you're fighting with yourself. Yeah. Yes, you are. Inner turmoil. Now, what kind of a really nice song have you got to sing about that? I got a uh, ghost in this house. Ghost. Ghost in this house. There's a, a ghost. Time. Uh, we got uh, nine minutes. Nine minutes. Okay, then. You put. Oh, this is okay. Okay. But go. Which one first? Ghost in this house. Or oh, this is something else I wanted to say. I was watching this old movie from 1990 or something called, uh, you know, the one with uh, Jennifer Love Hewitt in it. Yeah, yeah. What's yeah. it called? It is called. Heartbreakers. Heartbreakers. I think it's from 2000. Okay, and like I keep shutting it off, right? Like I can only watch 10 minutes at a time. Because mm -hmm. I don't have time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got no time. <laughs> and I, I opened it up, and it was right on the shot of her coming in the bar. Oh, yeah. And I think she's coming to in to suck a guy in. Yeah. And I think that's supposed to be the baby in this. But anyways, she's coming in. And I got to tell you, she is like hanging out like you wouldn't believe. This is like pornographic. <laughs> Much more pornographic <laughs> than if she was nude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I know what you're saying. And guess who's singing? Who? Baby, now that I found you, I can't let you go. Mm -hmm. And they've got it all orchestrated. She makes these moves and these yeah. moves. And Alison Krauss is singing, Baby, oh. now that nice. I found you, I can't <laughs> let you go. I build my world around you. <laughs> and it is a scene. I, I, I just pictured myself making that scene. Yeah. And I thought, oh, my God. Good work. I would never be able to do it. <laughs> it's pornographic, I tell you. <laughs> It's against my religion. Well, yeah, you had her ankles hanging you out. You take a look at the... Uh, everybody's probably going to start looking at that. <laughs> Everyone remembers that scene. Yep. It's that's iconic. If you, if you want to go against the grain of your crock, your life will be a crock. <laughs> but it might, might be a big evolutionary experience just before you die. If the, if the healthcare system gets a hold of you, you're a goner. Dad, did you uh, pick up the mail? Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, are you sure? I don't pick up the mail I don't answer the phone I don't answer the door I just assume me alone I don't keep this place up I just keep the lights down I don't live in these rooms I just rattle around I'm just a ghost in this house I'm just a shadow upon these walls Quietly as a mouse I haunt these halls I'm just a whisper of smoke I'm all slept two hearts on fire that once been out of control You took my body and soul I'm just a ghost in this house Just a ghost in this house I don't mind if it rains Hell, I don't care if it's clear I don't mind staying in Cause there's another ghost here she sits down in your chair Oh, she shines with your light And she lays down her head On your pillow at night I'm just a ghost in this house 
I'm just a shell of the man I was Living proof of the damage that heartbreak does I'm just a whisper of smoke I'm all that's left with two hearts on fire I once been out of control You took my body and soul Just a ghost in the sky Just a ghost in the sky Just a ghost in this house. <laughs> <laughs> just a ghost. You need to put the shades on so somebody can see you. You're just a ghost in this house, you fool. <laughs> you dippy little fool. <laughs> where are we going? Oh, mm. idea where? Oh. We're going down. Oh, no, no. This is really good. This is really good. Because you know how I talk all about what the brain does? Yeah. Which is actually sort of a m in a big way. Yeah. The earthly meaning of life. And I talk about... Uh, but I often say when you get to the end of that, that you know that that's what we're doing in our e earthly existence mm -hmm. is uh, survival, procreation, evolution. It's all part of evolution. Mm -hmm. Anyway, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. when you get to the end of that, mm -hmm. the obvious question that comes up, first thing, is where the hell are we ab ab evolution to? <laughs> you know, yeah. we're, we're evolution like a to beat the man. <laughs> There's eight billion of us now. Yeah. We're evoluting. Well, where are we evoluting to? Where are we going? But I was just thinking, I got more details on the earthly part. <laughs> 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 I know the other is there and it exists, and I've had the full on spiritual experience. Spiritual experience. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But, you know, if you want to talk like in the details that I talk about your earthly existence, mm -hmm. because that gets into soft science and psychology and anthropology and all that stuff, you know, that I know. Yeah. Oh, so well. <laughs> um, what about what about the earthly part, Dad? Did you already say it? I just oh, my my point of that whole <laughs> damn thing was this. What? But I got more details on what y'all are doing down here. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. In front of your face. Yeah. Trying to evolve. Yeah. And you don't. You got to know what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Enough of that. I know what we are doing and when. See, I, here's how this was supposed to go. The writer said this. It's supposed to go like this. And this phase is supposed to come first. I know what we are doing and when. Mm -hmm. And when I say we, I mean our species. See, that's supposed to be funny. Yeah. I know what we're doing and when, and when I uh, when I say we, mm -hmm. I mean our species, mm -hmm. not just me. <laughs> <laughs> I know what y'all are doing. I forget that now. Okay, we're long, good, we're long we're past good. it. Yeah, it's good. Are we gonna sing this Galdern song? It's very good because I've got the best writers in the business. Of course, we all know everybody's jealous of that. Trying to steal them from me, and I got Henry on the board. Keep the people back, the nervous hospital people back. Henry, there's lots of them in here tonight. They start throwing those uh, virtual haystacks. Mm -hmm. We'll be in trouble. Mm -hmm. Yes, we will, Ma. Mm -hmm. I can see you're getting kind of anxious about something, Ma. Two minutes. Okay, I'm not going to go. Okay, we got to sing a song. Mm -hmm. And is that the final? Is that's that the final song. Of this show? Yes. Okay. So we sang a series I'll talk about this later. It's about a dance going on between critique mm -hmm. and positive thinking. Oh. You know, because you would think people that are critical, yeah. critical. Yeah. But no, no, it's the opposite. Yeah. Because what's going on in the head, you're c being so critical. Your big brain mm -hmm. it's trying to figure believes it that you're going to get it. Yeah. It believes you're going to get it. Yeah. So your overall, you know, the croc, yeah. he's going, mm, yeah. I'll give you good brain chemistry for that. Yeah. That's what the croc does. He rewards you yeah. with brain chemistry. Yeah. Go against the croc. He turns the taps off. Yeah. No endorphin. No, turns them all down. You're mm -hmm. going, oh, I'm depressed. Yeah. No serotonin. Anyways, we'll talk again about that. No dopamine. Critique versus positive thinking. Mm -hmm. Because y'all know, right? Positive thinking works. <laughs> yeah. If you don't, just take a look at the President of the United States. He used to go to church every morning. Norman Vincent Peale. Yeah. Pounding it into him. You're and wondering look how at what the hell. <laughs> If you're wondering how a guy like that became president of the United States. Don't knock him now. I'm not knocking I'm just saying a guy like that. You can interpret we love that anyway. We, we love Joe. We love Don. We love everybody. 
you know, because we're on the, uh, what is it? We're on the Molly. Yeah. What's that? Oh, MDME. <laughs> We're not on anything, but we are going back to um, Fort Worth, where mm -hmm. I almost got killed down there. Mm -hmm. In reality, mm -hmm. it was a bit of a racial thing. Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to be black down there. <laughs> <laughs> they took one look at me and they said, "Break that boy's leg." <laughs> <laughs> I'm not black. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, but they said you sing like it. <laughs> That's good enough for us. <laughs> That's not what happened. <laughs> <laughs> I was singing a little bit. Much more legit than no, that. No, I had the shrimp there in the bar. It's because he brought the shrimp I in. I was doing a little bit. Of <laughs> Let me tell you about a place. Somewhere down in New York <laughs> way. Where the people are so gay. And they said, black man. He's a black man. He looks white, but he's a black man. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what happened. No, I was with a black taxi you driver. You brought a black taxi driver guy into the bar with you. Mm. Hang out. Mm. That was not allowed. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I was really cocky. Yeah. <laughs> and, and I didn't know. You didn't know. You're ignorant to the situation. Then uh, on TV, it sounded yeah. like everything was okay now. Yeah. Bill Cosby was the biggest thing on TV, <laughs> and <laughs> we, th we thought it was all wonderful. It ain't wonderful, and that's like many, many years ago. Yeah. <laughs> and now it looks worse. <laughs> Well, we see more of it. The blind, leading the blind. Yeah. You need to let the English back in there and get it straightened up. Because <laughs> yeah, I'm, tell they, I'm they telling you right now, all the DNA power and influence in America, the only united DNA power and influence in America is Russian DNA. Statement made. And you got to do your homework to figure that out. <laughs> okay, now let's sing my song. Let's about sing for <laughs> Not Russian. Hey, why yeah, say Russian? Yeah, sing the song. Sing the song. I shouldn't sing say Russian it. because that sing. narrows it down to a country, and that's like countryist. That's the wrong thing to do. <laughs> and I never did it, and I take it back. <laughs> sing the but dang they, song. What I should have said was Slavic. Is that better? There's a yes. <laughs> yeah, well, of course. Sing Slavic is perfect. Yeah, but now you're including. You got your Teutonic, your Slavic, the whole thing. Mm -hmm. What? Sing, sing the song. Sing the song, children. Yeah, it's like the guy said, wow. thousand words. What did he say? <laughs> said cold four words to your eight. Just ain't no, no he's good for jealous. I, I, you notice what he said was, l look at the, look <laughs> at this thing. I just got to explain this. He, the, th the only problem I found with this, it was very negative. A thousand words, words cannot express five fingers on the guitar. Depends who's uh, saying the words. No, but it's the, you could have said, what could you have said? You could have said, I uh, never you mind. You said that at the start. Shut up and, shut up and play the guitar. Stop talking and play no, the I guitar. I was just saying you could say that same thing the same way and it would be a little bit more posi positive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You could have could have said, uh, words are good, but five fingers on a guitar is worth at least a thousand of them. Mm -hmm. Cold Ford words, bear, it just ain't no good. We're jealous. I try it night after night. And those jeans, yours? You're in someone else's arms down in Dallas. Does four words ever cross your mind? Darling, while you're busy burning bridges, burn one for me if you get time. Cause good memories, they don't fade so easy. The sport words ever cross your mind. Yes, it does. Dallas, and I know it hurt you at 
at the time But I wonder now if it makes any difference The sport words ever cross your mind The sport words ever The sport words ever The sport words ever cross your mind Straight of confusion. The great Pacific Northwest and broadcasting around the world online. It's the really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the Truth. Now you keep the cards and letters coming in. And we're going to see you in the funny papers. And you all have yourselves a. Oh, the dog song. Holy crap, I was ending the show. Next time I do that, punch me. Okay, then that means it's time for Jerry Lee Lewis. Come along, baby, a whole lot of shaking going on. It's a dog shaking. Come along, baby, we got the chicken in the corn. It was your pressure that I was feeling. That ain't Dave. <laughs> My fault. Whole lot of shaking going on. Ooh, uh, how much, much is that, that dog? doggy? And the wind goes over the one with the waggly tail. She's got a waggly tail. I said, how much is that doggy? In a wind, a woman, I do hope that doggies are safe. Where she is, we're gonna go get Roger. We're gonna go walking in the sunshine, singing a little sunshine song. We're gonna put a smile upon your face as if nothing wrong. We're gonna think about a good time that you had a long time ago. Think about forgetting about your worries and your walking in the sunshine. Sing a little sunshine song. You go walking in the sunshine song. You go walking in the sunshine and sing a little sunshine song. Because you're at the happiness place on earth. Yeah, baby. Go on down to Patreon if you want to read about all that fancy stuff, which can cure anything. It's the medicine. That's why it is the medicine show, because we're always selling the medicine. Now, keep the cards and letters coming in, because you know what? We we cure Jimmy Joe all the time. Well, I, I should really tell the truth, and that is some other, sometimes it's other people, and I just use Jimmy Joe's name. Anyway. Keep the cards and letters coming in, and we'll see you in the plenty papers, and have yourselves a good old Dolce Beatles.